Since it came up earlier, why not? Holy shit, that was loud. No, it's too quiet. Game, you're killing me here. I guess we're playing on very hard then. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to lie. Part of it is the motivation that somebody might want to just buy something and then I'll, I'll make money off of it, which would be lovely. But, um... <laughs> Rat shadows. <laughs> okay, yeah, why not? But, um, I've, I'm never going to make it a secret. I'm never going to turn around and say, you know, hey, uh, I'm not going to tell you what's in my rig or what's on my setup. Because it, I think everybody should have the same opportunity. Streaming is, uh, is fun. And it should be shared with everyone. Okay. Well. Uh, unfortunately, my monitor and the stream do not sync up, so it's going to be a little bit brighter than expected, but I guess I had auto saves. You murder them. This is going to be a, um, a tribute to Cool's Villa, who kills everyone. So we're gonna we're gonna kill everybody Corvo, we can. If only there was someone else I trusted to send, On very so hard. that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the spy master was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home and bring good news. Surprise. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. You know, I'm feeling like this, maybe the resolution not is not right. Yeah, the resolution is not right. And if I ever played it on 1600 by 900, it's because I... Be like that. I also play this when I had a laptop. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat flip. I think Nostro might have stopped in on Saturday. When we were all uh, a little tipsy. I'm I'm not capable of pacifist runs. I get bored. There. I really like killing people. I give Cools a lot of shit about it, but the truth is, I, I love doing that. Turn it on the pipes, and she's rising. Oh, my last. Corvo can turn around a full 355 degrees. Shut her down. The Empress will be waiting for your news. Sir? 
I, I gave her a lot of shit when she was uh, when she was playing Deus Ex, the original, and I, I'm not gonna lie, I would I would have killed everyone. Fewer ships moving along the river now with the plague and all. I gotta say, this game looks ugly. Let's um, let's turn off anti-aliasing, and let's bump. I'll go back to full screen, but we'll do 4K. That's better. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Hello, sir. That oh, looks a lot better. All right. I got to downscale all the time. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait. Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. Do you have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Run with me! Later, will you give me more? Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Did I miss something? A surveillance camera? Do I know how to do any of this stuff yet? Maybe not. While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. I think she missed you. <laughs> Should we gather for whiskey? Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you the they sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. Hmm, I feel like you're evil. I'm not so I'd sure kill that you now if I could. Campbell. She'll see you at once. Let's see. Empress Jessamine. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. I like their footwear. They're, They're my citizens. And we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. Son, you look like a fucking vampire. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. Follow what me, news Captain. have you brought? We should leave them alone. I 
I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. I we can't get closer to you for some reason. This news is very It's bad. almost like it's a plot requirement. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. Oh, hello. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? Are you wearing a Fabergé? No, it's the locket. Yes, I don't see. worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Emily, get behind me! Look out! Another one! <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here, you're still gonna die. No more. Not again. Mommy! No! Get away from her! Oh, you done fucked up now. to do won't you Corvo oh that dude just spawned in on the left huh what us all look at what he's done yes he's killed the Empress oh clearly I've killed the Empress what did you do with young lady Emily traitor her own bodyguard ironic I'll see you beheaded for this Corvo take him Oh, so that's why it's it's called Dishonored. I suppose that makes sense. Everybody gonna die tonight. This is your final chance, Corvo. Sign the confession, and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. Hey, Corvo has a voice, That's though. enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now. You know Someone you're both gonna die. The weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this. Even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye. God, take it back to his cell. I'm uncomfortable with how often people call me Corvo. Like, if you're gonna talk to me directly, you probably won't use my name over and over you should again. Eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. It's just not natural. Okay, I'm going to need to read this out loud because I can't concentrate. Key to the cell, interrogation room, explosive, outer door, make for the river. Okay. Well, 
Well then, I guess. I'll... Attention! The solitary wing is off limits to make this crew. Hello. Accompanied by an officer of the walk. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Ow. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna kill everybody. Everybody's gonna die. I will also loot everyone. I see his crouch. I see. Hmm, hagfish, my favorite. What happened to Corvo? He got diabetes on his way out of the prison. Hello, Carlos. Oh. Oh. Sir. My apologies. I did not mean to take your head. Hey, look, the rats have shadows. <laughs> Sir Penguins, how are you? Thank you for the host. as soon as I can and then regret not being able to get some sleep. that I, I think I only played this game for like 10 minutes to make sure it worked. worked. I'll actually stealth kill one. This time. Ackworth, you lazy slut. I'm gonna walk out of here with a small fortune. Oh, you can kill the rats. I'm such a, an asshole. I'm sorry, rat. You didn't deserve that. I was just, I was just testing, and you just, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. What in the voice is that? 
<laughs> oh, um, yeah, sir, penguins. This is this is a, a playthrough dedicated to Cool's Villa. If you've watched or play any of these optional murder games, you know how this is gonna end. Also, the title should give it away. Not even the innocent are safe from me. Ooh. Okay, well, it wasn't as violent as it looked. But. Well, if there are any shirtless people here, we will take a look for nipples. I suppose that's a thing. Is that what they mean by giving them the business? Is that I thought this was going to be like a blunderbuss and cap incapable of hitting anyone, but I guess I can murder everybody from afar, too. No one is safe from Corvo. Can't let my wife see me play like this. She'll get upset. <laughs> I guess if you'll kill the Empress, you don't care about a few guards. Shut up. Let's Stop. Somebody's been down here. Bottle Street gang, maybe. Watch for booby traps. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? He's Sir Cole. <laughs> Okay, well, I don't feel so bad about killing the rat that one time anymore. I cannot kill the rat plague. Amanda and I had only enough coin to buy half the elixir we needed. Hmm. So maybe you should have just given her the elixir. Yeah, well, I guess that's that. How much money do I have? It's gotta be, gotta be sizable. We're probably not going to hide bodies either, because, you know, what's the point? I'm just going to kill everyone.
Oh, you just eat it immediately. I see. You know, old elixirs used to have uh, opiates in them. Aren't we supposed to load the bodies into carts headed to the flooded district? Yeah, but screw that. That's too far. I don't want to catch the flag, do you? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just dump them down there. Let the rats eat them. It's not a bad plan, to be honest. Assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. He is to be captured or killed at any cost. You don't mean that. See, the ladder mechanics are a little bit different than what I've become used to. That looks like a trap. Ooh, it super was a trap. Oh. I thought... Okay. Not a smart man. I deserve that one. Alright, so there's no way to undo the trap. But we can slide underneath them. Oh, okay. See, I'm learning, I'm learning. Get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take him out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. So get a hint. Knock something over if you can. Um, Bastard. I want to get past him because I might kill him.
Smells like a dead weeper. Seen anybody with signs of the sickness? Shut up. Can you get down with the sickness? Stay alert, you worms. He's not getting out this way on my watch. You know, I'm sure it looks super guilty that I'm killing everyone, but yeah, it's actually, I mean, it's more fun for me, but it's a little too easy, isn't it? You're not, you're not doing the work. Clearly the game is set up in a way that they want you to uh, sneak past everyone. I'm disturbed with how nonchalant they are about dumping bodies everywhere. This um, this world is kind of dark. Over here, quickly! I'm a friend. I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. It sounds like they want. You said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Killed 19 people. Holy crap, I got 602 of a possible 1010. Huh. <clears throat> Bilbo. Bilbo Baggins. This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Um, Sir Penguins, that's really going to depend on how I feel the first time I encounter a civilian. The, rest of the, loyalist. the Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, can clear your name, he can. It's very possible that I don't think this king kingdom should survive without its queen. walls here. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. You get whoever really killed the Empress. I didn't know I could kill him. That's amazing. Oh, I I guess I can't. Okay. So it's starting at last, Admiral. We found our man. Even after six months. Well, I tried. We 
We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, you look evil. I'm Admiral Havelock, a true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility. Just trying to make Cools proud. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with you. We've been building a coalition of loyalists aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself yeah, to Pierre. kind of an inbreeding thing it's challenging on. at times but his industrious mind buys him that right yes Piero's as much an artist as a technician he's going to be crafting the gear you'll need go talk to him and then get some sleep mm -hmm. we can talk more when you rest wow are, did you? Ju she just walked right by that. Did you see that? She just barely looked at him. She just kind of like, oh, he's dead. That's that's a thing. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear, all custom work for you. I will create the tools of a master assassin. He sounds like um, Otacon. Now the tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. The dispenser upstairs will provide you with a fresh tank of whale oil. They're heavy. But you are no doubt strong enough to carry one back down here, if you would. You're making a lot of assumptions there, bud. Wow, I'm... Handle them gently, or they will explode and kill us both. Actually pretty sh surprised by this. This is um, La Brad Dorif, who's always playing us that like that. That one is empty. A new tank. Yep, thank you. Just trying to be clean, sir. There's a lot of um, there's a lot of lore here that I'm never going to explore. Perfect. Now plug it in. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see the assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask. Yeah, that's super sexist. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. Okay, so I'm wanted for murder. Can you see normally? Um, lands out of the line. Regicide, actually. And there. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. So I'm guilty of regicide. Uh, but obviously, in order to keep people from recognizing me, what I really need is a, a mask that will definitely make me... Um, yes, please. Definitely make me... Uh, Unrecognizable. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. 
sleep well. I'm concerned with how much you want me to go to sleep. That's completely normal. Hello, Corvo. Oh, I didn't Your know I was playing has uh, has it Vampire the Masquerade. The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. I am the outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Did you just wink at me? Come find me. save her? Her makeup's not that bad. Her hands are huge, though. Wow. Like, my size hands. And again, nice boots. that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. It sounds kind of like he's got to a god complex. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing molded by my hands so yes yes he does with this heart you will hear many secrets and it will guide you toward my runes no matter how they may be hidden listen to the heart now and find another room this, this place, place is, is the, the end, end of all the Will devour all the lights in the sky. I 
It reminds me of, um... Uh, the never-ending story part two. I know that symbol. Open the journal. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. Now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Alright, so everybody's supposed to be ex um, examining each other's faces closely, but of course, I'm wearing a mask. That's totally normal, right? Perfectly normal. Don't make me sneak inside. I don't want to have to kill you all right now and then restart. Attention, Dunwall citizens. River traffic is forbidden from landing in the distillery district due to risk of infectious contact. Violators will be Did taken I clear to space the for Samuel then? For if you like, but he won't use it. Why? He can't sleep in regular beds anymore, or that's what he says. Says he was in the Navy too long. Can you believe it? Oh. That pile of wood out there? It's a hovel he built from an old rowboat. Where does Admiral Havelock find these people, I wonder? Sounds more like they find him. Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business. But sometimes, <clears throat> good men have to do bad things to make the world right. I Our tell purpose myself is clear. that all the time. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical Assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us. And if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's so a master like strategist, and he got caught working for our... A cause. crossbow bolt? It'd be good to have him back here at the house base. I could do that. Corvo. Hello. I was actually just about to I'm kill Calista. you. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but Doesn't this seem is like important. we kill anybody here. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. No, I was going to start with you. That wretched man. There's really no reason <clears throat> for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man. You sure I didn't kill family. him? The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. 
My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. I haven't even assassinated anyone Before yet. Before you became an assassin. How can... You're making a lot of assumptions, young lady. Just wondering, sir, if you thought about perhaps seeing Piero before venturing into the Overseer's Nest. Ready nope. to go? Let's just go. Just give the signal. All I need is bolts and some bullets. Ooh, I'm getting tired. a rough trip. It used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes, like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. <laughs> not giving me a lot of reasons not to kill everybody. Let's go. It's nearly midnight. But easy, damn it. Keep them in the boat. Canal's got enough shit in it as it is. <laughs> Hey, what is it? I think that last one was moving. What? Yeah, the little one. Not what possible. I, I inspected them myself. Keep working. Well, he ain't moving no more. <laughs> well, that one was upset Damn. about. So yeah, I guess I made a decision on that. Good. Keep them coming. Half the block dead from the plague. Better them than us. At least some of them have money. I know. Gotcha now. I'll find you, you hagfish. Hagfish, sir. All right, so there's a rune nearby. And that was not what I was looking for. It's number six. I can feel the pre-age ending. Oh, there's a couple of runes nearby. And bone charms. How much we can abuse this.
almost want some. on a pale horse. Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, in this continuing crisis, the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce order whenever and wherever necessary. We all are thanks to High Overseer Campbell. I just failed an objective for murder. Of their services. That's fine. Ow. Ow, I'm gonna die from rats. Size of those fucking rats. Oh my god. He must have been up there. We can go find out. Send us food, not bullets. So, yeah, send us nudes. Attention, Dunwall citizens. John Clavering Boulevard has been designated a restricted travel area. Any citizens are liable to search or... Ooh, I did not know that was going to explode. Of the city watch. I guess I should have known. Oh, I just... Okay. But I have to start the whole thing all over again, too. Take it a step at a time. Attention, Dunwall citizens. This is a special announcement from our honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Hiya, Regent fellas. speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. Who wants some? In addition, in this continuing crisis. Oh. Never mind, it killed you. Remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce order whenever and wherever necessary. <laughs> we all are thanks to my overseer Campbell for the generous load of the Oh, I totally didn't even see you guys. I'll catch you now. Hey, buddy. Watch. 
so I suck. You made someone a widow, damn you. We'll just do it quieter. Are you shitting me? You won't stay hidden for long. <laughs> we got a prowler on the loose. Yeah, Nostro, death death is imminent. Death is um death is what I do. I like to experiment. skill you'd be watching a speedrunner that was grotesque <gasps> I can pick up the head guys you can pick up the head Oh, that's so cool. Anybody interested to come get some of this? Supposed to let him go. Huh? Oops. Roger that, Nostra. Enjoy your coffee, sir. So, I hear the second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. Psst. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do, and I can help. Can you go? Unlock me and I'll buy you a drink in a couple of days. By the void, I'll buy you a hundred drinks. Oh, there had to be a key, huh? I have poor circulation and I seem to have forgotten my mittens, so I'd appreciate it if you could release me or at least go gather some firewood. <sighs> Feels good to stand up straight. <sighs> Thank you, Corvo. What you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance. We've got to find Emily. So kill Campbell and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal, his notorious black book, and get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kernow. 
And word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help. Mostly on accident. I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. If I see Samuel the boatman, I'll tell him to pick you up. Behind the office. I was just reading in the archive about the heretic's bread. It sounds painful. Have you ever seen the ritual? I've never seen the heretic's bread used. No, it's a rare occurrence. But I did spy the face of one so brazen. A former member of our order, of course. Out on a retreat, we passed through a fishing town and saw him begging. What were his crimes? Who can say? The brand is reserved for an overseer. Or even the High Overseer himself, who violates our codes and must be cast out permanently. Remember the Seven Strings. Where is he? Damn! Someone's been killed! A body! Someone will pick up the outsider! Where are you? Got you now! Guards! To me! Ah! Come on! Sir, the kicking is dirty. Don't do that. Oh, this game is violent, yo. Make you some brandy. You're a fine girl. All right, thanks a lot, Sir Penguins. Hope you have a good day at work. Assassin, help! Goat baby goat. I don't know. I get it. Your guards can't even walk there at night on account of slack jaws operation. The watch doesn't care about a few kids. Maybe the overseer should go down there. The Abbey of the Everyman has business. Oh, that guy was wearing a helmet. What's up, dude? That's it. That the, the alarm just goes away. Everybody's dead. The alarm goes away. And that's that. You don't even look like you're part of this mission. But fuck you anyway. Did 
just they're just sitting there letting me do it. if I said I knew about this before, but it was pretty obvious, wasn't it? Paintings could be worth money. That puts a new spin on things. All right. Let's go kill the guy we're here to kill. You see that? I picked him up by his face to kill him. Corvo is hardcore. Hard Corvo. the microfilm. Searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found our safe place to hold up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. Time for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass all the quicker. Mark, one of the servants must have been in here. Let me see. It seems I have the wrong one. Not that one. No. Ah, here we are. Now if you'll join me. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Tonight, chances are very good. I might not be good at games, but I can shoot. <coughs> I 
also don't have any fucking health because I used it all. Because I'm terrible. Yeah, you got any help? We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I don't believe I you. I must get my sister to safety. But first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Shot man. Whoops. That was the end of my bolts too. Unfortunate. Yeah, you know, in case there was any question about it, that was straight up murder. RF Taker, thanks for joining the crew. Welcome to Deep Space Expendable, where apparently murder is free. think about that at all. It'll take a little while for me to get used to these controls. And apparently to stop tripping. Yep, peaceful NPCs are probably the most expendable. I learned that from Captain Zisco himself. That's how we get rid of rats. I thought it would be useful, but it wasn't. Get out of here. Vamanos. How nearby is nearby? Oh, there's a room right underneath me. Oh, and you are so dead, my friend. They gave me too much to do at the end of this stage. I 
Um, my Spanish is okay. I understand it better than I speak it. My Korean is non-existent. I know like three phrases. Annyeonghaseyo. Is pretty much it. Who is here? I know little phrases from uh, from a lot of languages. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna need that one. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, no, actually I had to learn Spanish on my own. Took it in high school. Spoke English. And it's not my mom didn't try. She definitely did try to teach us Korean. We just didn't have any, any interest in it. Because you don't know any better when you're a kid, you know? say the audio engine of this game is not conducive to this kind of stealth. So much lore. But this is very immersive if you're ever taking the time to play. But your intent? To spread the malady to us? No, we're going Forgot it was a kennel. So I'm going to exercise the better part of valor. <laughs> I have a feeling I almost died there. Hey, Corvo. It's Samuel. From the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty bosh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. That was close. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. Forty-five people killed. Four civilians killed. High chaos. Uh, I did save Captain Grinnell. You think that other girl will go on a date with me now? Admiral Havelock and Lord Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect they'll want to congratulate you. She's definitely here to talk to me, though. He 
he's alive. Thank you, Corvo. Thank you. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. He did try to kill me. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons, but I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. I'm wait a second because her voice sounds super familiar. Um Callista Kurnow. Callista Kurnow is Lena Headley. She's British. So she was she was literally not having a British accent on purpose. So it, it really seems more like the intent was to strip the British accent. I I am not actually enjoying the, the acting. I think it's very stilted. It's kind of the same thing that happens whenever you give... Um, you, I don't know how to describe it, but I think what, what happened here is they wrote the dialogue very exposition heavy in order to produce more of the lore. And instead of sounding natural, it sounds stilted with the expectation that people who are you know, actually film actors will be able to deliver it better. And it never works out that way. Yes. Hopefully the high over... You did it. Somehow you took down the high overseer Campbell against the odds. Well, I did kill 45 people. I knew people. you were our man, Corvo. With Campbell gone, we've hurt the Lord Regent immeasurably. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself Sir. in the wall tower. Yes. And Campbell's journal, let's not forget. Our hope is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Our entire movement will mean nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord <coughs> Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal her, to step out as the hero and further cement his regency. If he doesn't bring the young lady forth soon, there will be infighting among the nobles as to who should succeed the Empress. Yes, time is against us. But now you should take a well-earned rest, Corvo. We will decipher the contents of the High Overseer's journal and share them with Leif. My, there is something to you, isn't there? You went and spanked the High Overseer in his own house. I hope that... Can I be of service to you? Okay. Well, I can buy a room. I don't think I have the option to buy anything here. Oh, well, then time. Shadow kill. Ooh. It had to have been a decision that they made um, artistically. said to have been a decision that they they purposefully went out of their way to go and say well we're not doing British this time it's fine I suppose it's just different nothing in the law says steampunk has to be they weren't even hiring British voice like these the people who are playing characters in this game are not um, voice actors these are film actors who are like Brad Dorff and uh, Emily 
Emily's played by, by Chloe, Chloe Grace Moritz. So it's not like they didn't have the option to draw from a larger talent pool. Not that there isn't a fairly large talent pool for British actors in voice acting. In fact, had they hired British voice actors, they probably could have avoided the union dues. What a fish. Sorry, but my ego just can't take this right now. My sword is covered in blood. That's a nice touch. The Admiral was right in recruiting you. Nothing's been the same since the Lord Regent took power. But at least Campbell's gone and my uncle lived. I just want to point out how bad her American accent is. It's terrible. Next time I see my uncle, I will not mention my knowledge of any of this. But he will wonder why I'm smiling. I just don't understand. And she's got a beautiful voice. Oh well, it is what it is. Oh, but this is a good time to call it because I do have to go to work a little bit early tomorrow. Um, Friday night, Saturday night, it looks like I'm going to be tuning into some horror games uh, because I'm very interested in, in playing stuff like uh, uh, Outlast and uh, Alien Isolation, so I'll probably be doing, doing some of that. Um, maybe Resident Evil, because it's been a really long time since I played a Resident Evil game. Thanks for stopping out, Nostro, appreciate it, as always. Your, uh, your support means a lot. Everybody else who came out, Sir Penguins, uh, Luna Karak, Luna Karak, um, Pitsy. I, uh, yeah, I think I think the new, next few days, you know, it's 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 October. It's the end of October. We'll do some horror games and probably continue for a little bit. And uh, we'll also check back in and Dishonored every once in a while because I, I had fun. I, I mean, I had fun, but I, you know, killed a lot of people. So what can I say about that that uh, would sound same? No, it's not going to happen. But we'll call it a night. We'll see you again on Friday um, and, uh, and Saturday and maybe Sunday and definitely Monday. So we might have four days straight depending on how Sunday looks. Uh, but have a great night. Thank you again for stopping out. Um, I'll see you when the plot requires it. And until then, be excellent to each other. <laughs>